Today we are here at the Forest Regeneration Center in Goldsby, Oklahoma, and it's actually a little bit of a farm, but a different crop that we're growing. And we're going to take a look today at these trees. Joining us today is Jer Irby, who is the manager and operator of all of this activity out here. Jer, thanks so much for talking with us today. Thanks for coming. So tell us a little bit about what this center is responsible for doing. Yeah, so here at the Forest Regeneration Center, we grow tree seedlings around four and a half million a year. And those seedlings go out to conservation plantings all across the state. So right here, we're lifting some of those seedlings, as you can see, the best time to lift those trees is right now in the winter. And so they're gonna go out for different conservation plantings like wildlife enhancement, reforestation, Christmas tree growers, love our trees and all sorts of great projects. So when you talk about the winter months, it's January through February is really the time that you're doing this? Yeah, so we'll start lifting in January and continue lifting until around the 1st of April. All right, so lifting meaning harvest, right? Right, correct. <laughs> so tell us a little bit about the process of growing these seedlings. Uh, these aren't traditional trees that you're getting here. They're smaller. Right, so they are seedlings. So a lot of them are either a year or even a less than a year old. Um, we collect a lot of the hardwood seed that you see back here, these seedlings, all across the state. So this is native um, trees that will go out, collect the seed, bring it back, plant it in the ground, and then we'll lift it and send it out. Some of our pine seed actually comes from our orchard down in Idabel. We'll harvest those those cones, process them, and then stratify, put them in the ground, and then lift them as well. Excellent. So tell me a little bit about who your customers are. Can anybody buy these trees? Yeah, anyone can buy our seedlings as long as there's a conservation project. So like I mentioned, reforestation is a big one, wildlife enhancement. Um, you know, they can order starting October 1st, and so they can place their order on our web store, or they can pick up the phone and call us. Um, so, so start October 1st, and then we start lifting in December, start shipping them out in January, and um, they can plant them right then when they get them. All right, so we're on the tail end of people ordering. There might be some that are already sold out, so mark your date right. for October. Over. Exactly. So tell us a little bit about what the number of trees that you have and what selection you have to offer people. Yeah, so we both we grow both hardwoods and conifers, um, bare root seedlings. So those are seedlings that we lift and shake the dirt off the roots. And so you have to order a minimum of 100 seedlings, um, but they come in bundles of 50. And so you can get two species if you would like to um, do it that way or just get 100 trees um, and get them into the ground. So we also grow container trees. Um, so for folks that have maybe a harsher site, they can um, purchase those uh, uh, containers to get a little bit of step up on those trees and uh, get them in the ground as well. Excellent. And tell us a little bit about, like, what if somebody doesn't know what they need to get? I know your website yeah. has a lot of information, but can they contact you? Sure. And do you have conservation packages? Yeah, so our website has a lot of information when it comes to hardiness zones, soil types, maybe what tree will be the best tree for a shelter belt, for instance. But, you know, we are here to help answer any of those questions when it comes to what tree to plant. You know, our goal is to get the, the right tree in the right place. And so um, they can call our office and talk to me or some of our staff, and we can help guide them in their tree planting decisions. Okay, well, I know Oklahoma landscape changes dramatically from east to west, north exactly. to south, and that might mean choosing different trees, right? Right, and you know, we're pretty unique here at our nursery. We grow over 30 varieties of tree species, so we want to make sure we're taking care of folks down in McCurtain County and all the way into the Panhandle. So we have a variety of species available to help meet their conservation needs. And a lot of people might have your trees that they didn't realize were your trees, right? You work a lot with different groups and uh, up with trees and trees. Tree, uh, tree giveaways and things yeah. like that? Yeah, so we partner with a lot of different organizations and um, we're at a lot of different um, Arbor Week events throughout the state where we um, will donate seedlings so we can make sure that we're doing our uh, mission by protecting the, the natural resource here in our state and planting more trees. Excellent. Well, thank you so much for sharing this with us. Yeah, thanks.
We hope you enjoyed this video as part of our Oklahoma Gardening YouTube channel. You can also find even more videos on the OK Gardening Classics YouTube channel. And join us on social media for great gardening tips, photos, and discussion.